All right, for this one, we did the same thing. We go from rest, that tells me the initial velocity is zero, to a velocity of 122 meters per second when being launched. That's our final velocity. If the deck of the carrier is 158 meters long, that's meters, it's talking about distance, it's telling me how far we've gone. I want to know what acceleration must we have when we're being launched. So that's the thing we're after, that's the acceleration. So you guys have identified all of your knowns and your unknown already, and you picked the correct equation here because we have velocity, velocity, acceleration, and we need distance. It's velocity, velocity, acceleration, we need distance. So we're going to plug in all of our numbers right here. We'll go blue. So 122 squared is equal to 0 squared plus 2 times the acceleration, which we don't know. So we'll just leave it as an A times delta x, which is 158. So we're going to want to, first off, that zero is gone. We're going to square 122, and then we're going to multiply 158 by 2. All right, so here we have 14,884 is equal to, when you multiply 2 times 158, you get 316 times the acceleration. So in order to solve for the acceleration, we're going to divide both sides by 316. So 316 goes away. And that tells us that the acceleration is 47.1 meters per second squared. That's going to be our acceleration there.